Hello and welcome to the session. In this session, we will discuss a question which says that the principal of a school having 728 students asked the students about how many of them wear glasses. The results are shown in the following two-way table. Now in this table, we have to find the missing frequency. Then in second part, we have to find that how many students wear glasses occasionally. In the third part, we have to find that how many girls never wear glasses. And then we have to find and interpret the sum of entries in each row and column. Now let us start with the solution of the given question. Now in this question, we are given a two-way table that shows the number of students who always wear glasses, who wear it occasionally and who never wear glasses. Now in the first part we have to find the missing frequency. Now in this question, total number of students surveyed are given as 728. Now here, sum of all the frequencies is equal to total number of students surveyed. So here, let us add all these frequencies and let the missing frequency be x. So this implies 40 plus x plus 248 plus 38 plus 62 plus 180 is equal to 728. And this further implies 568 plus x is equal to 728 and this implies x is equal to 728 minus 568 which is equal to 160. So here the missing frequency is equal to 160. Now in the second part we have to find that how many students wear glasses occasionally. Now students include both boys and girls. Now here, see number of boys wearing glasses occasionally, which is 160, and number of girls wearing glasses occasionally, which is 62. So, Total number of students who wear glasses occasionally is equal to 160 plus 62 which is equal to 222. Now in the next part we have to find that how many girls never wear glasses. Now to find how many girls never wear glasses, see the second row showing girls and corresponding column of never wearing glasses. Here the frequency is 180. So, number of girls never wearing glasses is equal to 180. Now in the last part we have to find and interpret the sum of entries in each row and column. Now we have this table. Now let us write the total of each row and column. First of all, let us add the entries in row 1. 
and this will be 14 plus 116 plus 248 which is equal to 448 it means the total number of boys are 448 now let us add the entries in the second row and it will be 38 plus 62 plus 180 which is equal to 280 and this gives us the total number of girls and now let us add the entries in column 1 in the first column the entries are 40 and 38 so 40 plus 38 is equal to 78 and this gives number of students always wearing glasses and now let us add the entries in column 2 this will be 160 plus 62 which is equal to 222 and this gives number of students wearing glasses occasionally and now let us add the entries in column 3 so this will be 248 plus 180 which is equal to 428 and this gives number of students never wearing glasses. Now 448 plus 280 is equal to 728 and 78 plus 222 plus 428 is again 728. And this gives the total number of students. In this way, we have got the sum of entries in each row and column. And this is the solution of the given question. That's all for this session. Hope you all have enjoyed the session.